Greetings and hallucinations, ladies and lads. I am Chancellor of the Harmonious Frequencies of the Mighty Empire of Onion, and this is Crusader Kings 2 with Fortmaster. Yep. Ooh. Uh, for some reason, I've got a thousand troops in your territory. I'm not sure how that happened. <laughs> yeah, that is weird. I had one cavalryman in my uh, um, capital as well. Hmm. Okay, so what is it that I do next? Uh, truce is, is expiring. Who's the truce? Oh, with this guy. Okay. Though, wait a second. What, what, is my, what are my troops looking at? like? Uh, 18,000 guys? Hmm. Uh. So if I was to declare... Ah, oh, yeah. Succeeded in my border dispute to get that little county. Yay! Now your name's just that little bit bigger. That's right. Right now, I'm feeling like I have more property, but my name's smaller just because my my land kind of, like, curves around. True, yeah. Um... Yeah, so, if I was... I could declare... So, wait, how do you want to do this? Do you want to... So, the ground... Like, the land underneath Toledo... Um... I was kind of thinking we if we could try to split that in half, and then we kind of like and then or whatever. Or I go after Toledo and uh, Aragon, and you take the rest of the Islamic land. Okay. Does that work? Uh, that works for me. Yeah. Mm, wait. Uh, betrothal. My daughter and the king of Pomerania. He is so he wants to arrange a, this thirty-seven-year-old wants to arrange a marriage with my twelve-year-old daughter. Wow. That's a little iffy. <laughs> yeah, well, it's a betrothal. Not, they won't get married until she's 16 and fertile. True, true. So, do you have an, um, how are you doing on troops and, like, money and stuff? Can you call another Reconquista? Because if I call it, then I'll get the land. Uh, yeah. I was just disbanding the guys from the thing. Let mm -hmm. me see. Um, intrigue. I I can't I can't call for a reconquista right now. Really? Yeah. Like, is it just grayed out, or you don't have the option? I don't have the option at all. I could found a new empire. Oh no, not quite. I have to have prestige of eight thousand. <laughs> Eight thousand prestige and hold three kingdom titles. Not quite there. I could I could found a new uh, empire though. Oh nice. Though so for, so for me it's only a thou. Uh, yeah, for me it's only a. Th oh, okay, yeah. There's eight thousand prestige. Okay, it cost a thousand gold to do so. Empire of Castile. Oh no, my daughter is becoming Portuguese. Oh no! That must be stopped. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> oh, I did find a kidney though that I added to my treasury, as a and a liver, and cloven oh, hooves. <laughs> as for alchemy ingredients. Oh, it's oh okay. So <laughs> liver, cloven hoof. Okay. Yep. Yep. The finest animal parts. <laughs> Do. Um. Actually, wait, can I call a Reconquista, or is it a cooldown? Because I also uh, called one. Um. No, I can just. The only options I have are I can shut the gates or compose a book. Oh. Um, wait. What? Why can you shut the gates? Do we have a epidemic? No. Uh. No, but I guess it's just an option you can always do. Oh. Okay. Um, okay, wait. Who, who are some, okay, so let's see. What kind of what what claims can I can I can I do? Ah, okay. So many things are popping up. Ah, why? Yeah. Bishop, because you shipped a title of I don't care. Okay, so I have like a du jour claim on this little be uh, piece of territory. Weak claims. I can't. Apparently, I have a weak claim on the Kingdom of Norway. Huh. 
and the county of Haves in Hungary. Uh, yeah, I can, I can, I could vassalize Toledo. That would be pretty good, wouldn't it? Yeah, I could. I could just vassalize them. That way you don't have to try to fight them. Yeah, then, yeah, I just get that one little... Actually, I'll wait until they're finished their war, because it looks like they're fighting over that little piece of land that separates the territory. Aha. That way, when they're nice and weak, I shall just swoop in and take what is rightfully mine. All the Kingdom of Norway wants my uh, sister to marry... Let's see... Good, good bread. Good bread. Yeah, I guess he's the hey. heir of Norway. Would you like some good bread? <laughs> Apparently, I have a weak claim on there. I could, I could declare war on. Nice. Oh wait, adventurer threats. Oh, not this again. Uh, do I? Am I currently doing a plot or anything? No, I'm not. I'm going to just... I want this man killed. Oh, my wife is mad at uh, my spy master because he's annoying. <laughs> really? That's all? Yeah. He's just, he's just annoying? Yeah, sadly, I'm going to have to give her a minus five opinion of me. <laughs> oh, jeez. What the? Um, I got a revolt. Have an, uh... Yeah, apparently I can attack that, too. Oh, wow. I got presented with an opportunity to let everyone be reminded of my rulership by minting new coins. Okay. Okay. Uh. Do you need any help with that? Wow, it's 10,000 dudes? I may, yeah. Uh, yeah, okay, I'm coming. I got my 22,000. Uh, it's heretics, I guess. Okay. Curse renegades. Okay. Um, yeah. Let me let me get my military guys up. Isn't there a way where you can raise levies? Uh, yeah. Hold control, and it they don't come up where the hostiles are. Uh oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. So if you want to pause the game, uh, the troops. Got it. Uh, I may not need help, actually. I just wrecked them. Oh, okay. I guess they were just really bad, then. Yeah, I won right away. <laughs> <laughs> they sucked! You know what? Wait, who's Aragon, uh, who's, um, Aragon at war with? So they're at war with... Wait, are they at war with one of my vassals? Is that why? Okay, apparently they're at war with two people. Weird. Now my mom is mad about my chancellor. <laughs> what is it? It's like, do the women in your life just not get, a, get a, along with anybody? <laughs> I guess so, yeah. It's crazy. Let's see. Can I... Uh, what would I have to do to lower... Resist the foul impulses, yes. Oh no. <laughs> um Oh I I can't I, I can't change uh login until for two years. Okay. That sounds about right. I'm building an observatory in one of my hospitals. Oh, very nice. I'm upgrading the sick houses because right now I have, what is this, uh, measles spreading through my land. Oh, geez, that's not good. Yeah, it's very bad. It's almost gotten my entire uh, territory in the north. Really? Yep. Spent like half my money on uh, upgrading sick houses. <laughs> <laughs> well, you must help the poor. That's right. Oh, geez, what do I got? Oh yeah, the measles is starting to spread to mine. No. Oh no. I think this. I think this would be a good time to close your gates. Yeah, it's not a bad idea.
Oh, the queen is suffering from the measles. Oh no. Yeah, it's getting bad. Hopefully it'll burn itself out. Yeah. I'm just going around and upgrading some of my uh, vassals' uh, land. Oh, okay, it's telling me to close my gates now. Oh no, it's almost here! The measles! <laughs> Oh, uh, my wife is pregnant while she has the measles. This can't be good. Oh, no. Actually, wait a second. I need to see. Um, uh, oh, uh -huh. nice. Okay, so my capital uh, my capital with the hospital and everything has 40% epidemic resistance. Oh, very nice. So pirates have been marauding in increasing numbers all along the coast of Galicia recently. And worse, there's a rumor among the common folk that the pirates are being aided by Castilian agents. Queen hey. Gontroda, the Castilian. Uh-huh. Hey, no, that was not me. I must send a letter to the Queen and find out if it's so. <laughs> oh, hey, I just got your letter. <laughs> uh, and we've experiencing a play... Oh, jeez, I wonder. Uh, dear Queen G uh, Gontera, uh, we are experiencing a plague of pirates on our coast, and there is a rumor that you are supporting them. Can you please put, your, put my mind at ease regarding this, for I assume that it is not true. Or is it? <laughs> <laughs> and then my options are, I must reassure him, which means I lose 50 prestige, but I answer cordially. Um, and then the op other one is, a strange accusation. He is up to something. Which, <laughs> which gets me 50 prestige, but I answer accusingly. Oh, no. Are you up to something? <laughs> <laughs> of course not. Of course Okay, I'll just answer cordially. I can afford to lose 50 prestige. <laughs> That's what I had to do to Aragon the other day. Oh, uh, now we've got Camp Fever and Faro. Gross. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I get to lose 50 prestige as well by saying that it puts my mind at rest. <laughs> okay. Being trusting apparently does not help with prestige. All right. Oh, and apparently I fulfilled my... I see, I saw my realm prosper by not going to war for five years. Wow. I surprisingly have no factions in my kingdom, and uh, only one known plot. Really? I have two factions, so Duke Lupe II for Leon, and... Yeah... Um, and then... Oh! Wait a second, what's going on here? Um... Raymond Burgundy of Raymond Burgundy's host has declared Rom Raymond Burgundy's host claim on the Leon War for Queen for Queen Godfrey's the Castilian. Okay, where are these people? I must raise my troops. Oh, and I oh, and um, apparently I I finished my book I was working on. It's called The Legends of Jamina. Oh, nice. Let's see, what does that do? Legends of Jambina, it's quality 2, uh, gives me points, 2 monthly prestige, my dynasty has plus 5 options. Uh, the description is, a queen must do all in her power to, uh, to highlight the glories of her house. This tome sets a great standard. Okay. Oh. Uh, right now I'm composing an educational book of some kind. Ah, uh, there's the host. It's coming. Okay, so now we just finally approve the plan to kill him. Of course. Alright. Uh, I'm celebrating my life in seclusion. After finishing a hearty breakfast, I belch contentedly and remark upon my foresightedness in ensuring Karunia's larders were well stocked. However, as soon as the words leave my lips, I notice the suddenly panicked look on my servant's face... My king, you just ate the very last pickled boar's head. And almost all our food stocks are nearing exhaustion. Furthermore, oh. <laughs> your servant continues to drone on, but you are too aghast to listen. No more pickled boar heads. <laughs> oh, no! This isn't good. <laughs> no! Not the pickled boar it's, heads! <laughs> so, I think I may have to open the gates. 
Oh, Thanks I can attacking. I can construct a laboratory now. I'll definitely do that. Nice. For science. <laughs> we got below. Victory. And he is dead. Yes. I didn't even have to kill him in battle. He did, my nice. pl my plan to kill him just worked. <laughs> uh, how do you see the religion? Oh. Catholic heresy. So, Catholic heresy is spreading in my county of Lugo, up by my capital. What? Really? Yeah. It's called Fraticelli. I never... Never heard of that. That is silly. Um, wait, let me look up. What is that? Because I'm pretty sure that it may have been a, a, something real. Um, how do you? Sp it's frat is silly. Okay. Oh no, that's not it. That's for pizzas. <laughs> uh, CK two. Fratricelli. Uh, fratricelliism. Uh, Fratricelliism you know, is a her heretical Catholic sect uh, that's separated from uh, the Franciscan order on account of disputes concern, uh, concerning poverty. Uh, its followers are extreme proponents of the rule of St. Francis of Assisi, um, especially with regards to poverty and regards of wealth of the church as scandalous. Um, and that of individual churchmen as invalidating their status. Huh. Okay. Yeah. Oh no. I think I'm getting sick. Are you? I hope you have a good doctor. Yeah, I've got a fever. Dang it. I just only... hired a court physician, so... <laughs> I got a fever, and the only cure is more cowbell! <laughs> That's right, yes. <laughs> Yeah, he's worried I'm developing smallpox. Uh, he strapped me to a chair and had me sleep sitting upright for days. My health is at plus <laughs> <Okay>. two now. <laughs> well, I mean, at least the good thing is it's starting to bur measles is starting to burn out in your territory, and it hasn't spread to my capital yet. So I'm just going to um, open my gates since I. Oh, I've got a ton of stuff going on right now. I gotta pause for a second. Oh, okay. I'm importing uh, tools from the laboratory because my blacksmiths are incompetent. <laughs> uh, ignorant laboratory equipment can appear both frightening and alien. A small mob has assembled outside, demanding why I'm constructing so clearly ungodly things. <laughs> oh, jeez, okay. I'm going to have to try to accommodate them. So I'll explain to about my laboratory. And then, uh, yeah, my physician has come to see me and offers treatment for my illness. He explains there are several types of treatment he can offer. We try something new, uh, because I have the brave trait. <laughs> um, and then risks. Uh, it doesn't tell me which one are the is the best option, though. There's a chance the treatment has negative effects, is all it really says. It's really up to you. Oh, man. We'll go with what he knows. All right. Yeah. Oh, no. What What happened? He brought a goat into my chambers. Uh, this foul smell of its flatulence made me both cover my noses, but the uh, physician whoops, uh, pulled my hand away. Apologies, this is the treatment. <laughs> Apparently, I have to take <laughs> deep breaths of the goat farts. <laughs> Okay. I actually feel better. Martial intrigue, diplomacy, stewardship, and learning are all at plus two, as well as health. Well, okay then. 
I think I had one where I had cancer, and the cure that the physician suggested was I run through the forest naked, and it worked. <laughs> oh, I wrote a uh, excellent paper on the planets. It explores astrology, uh, the movement of the planets, and what could be interpreted as... As what? Uh, the, uh, what the movement of the planets can be interpreted as. Oh, okay. Like astrology, basically. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. Oh, yeah. Man, everybody I sent it to is, um, accepting of the work and they're putting it up in their libraries. Nice. Ah, good. The measles is burning out. It's, uh, it's it's like now just in a couple of provinces. Very nice. Hmm. Apparently he's Midas touched. Oh, yeah, I finally had a son. <laughs> I have, like, four kids now, at least. Let me see. Yeah, four kids, and only one of them, my youngest, is a son. <laughs> well, okay, then. Excuse me. I swear, I keep getting this thing talking about how, like, oh, if I don't change my diet, I'm going to be fat. Oh no. <laughs> Don't get fat. Hmm. Oh, I got an ambition of the king. After months of hard work and considerable amount of money spent, the laboratory is the envy of anyone who wishes to delve into the deeper secrets of life. The Office of Alchemy allows the king to perform any experiment that has so far been documented and is a testament to the great ambition in the field. All right. Nice. So I gained 30 uh, economic technology points, uh, increase of prestige and learning. Pretty awesome. Very nice. Okay, wait, so I just pause. I just need to change what my court ears are doing. Um, I don't really need to train troops. Let's have you spread, um, military tech. Um, and how are you doing in here? Uh, oh yeah, that province is now Catholic, yay! So let's have you spread cultural tech. Oh, wait, what? Um, did you know you you just gained that pro uh, that land that I thought Toledo was fighting for? Oh, wow. I had no idea. <laughs> that, that must have been one of your vassals. Right? Huh, okay then. I guess I'll just, uh, I guess I'll just declare war on Toledo then. Uh, vassalize them. That is what I will do. Oh no! This is that Lishbuna guy, that Muslim uh, count. Oh really? Oh, he's converted to Catholic now, though. Oh, that's good at least. Amazing. That's gonna do it for this episode. If you want to catch another one, be sure to subscribe. Consider supporting my channel through the Patreon link down in the video description, and feel free to check out any of my other videos or playlists that you might be interested in. I thank you so much for all the time that you spend on my channel. And I hope blessings of wisdom and peace on all of you. Farewell.